I hope you're having a wonderful day. In today's video, I wanted to share with you um, the things that we use for nappy changing. I thought it might be useful to have a quick run through about the things that we have on hand that make nappy changing much easier. So firstly are the actual nappies. So what the nappies that we use are these ones. They're um, the Pampers Premium ones, and we've used those since Theo was born and They've been great, so we haven't really had any um, reason to, to switch them or try others. But I know from speaking to other mums that they found it useful to actually try different nappies and see which ones work well from, for them. But I can definitely recommend the Pampers Premium ones. They work really well for us. The other thing that we have are the baby wipes. Now, we use these Huggies Pure ones, which are 99% pure water. Um, originally we were using the water wipes as they were recommended to us by friends and also midwives but we actually found them to be really wet really cold and especially during kind of nighttime nappy changes when Theo was very little we just found them kind of too cold on his skin at that time in the morning or during the night and so we decided to switch to something else and the Huggies ones have worked really well they're nice they're soft they're not as wet as the water wipes and we've had no issues with them whatsoever, so they work really well for us. The other thing that we have are these, these cotton pads. Now, I love these because they come in so handy for many reasons. They're quite big, as you can see, and quite absorbent. So what I do is when I'm changing Theo's nappy, when I wipe him with the wet wipe, I also give him a bit of a dry before I put any cream on. And the other thing that these come in really handy for is when little boys are very little and you're changing their nappies, I found that as soon as you take that nappy off, then they decide that's the time when they want to pee. So it was always handy to have a couple of these ready before I even began to change Theo's nappy, just so that if needed, I could mop up any, any spills or kind of stem the flow, as it were, when he decided to pee when I took his nappy off. So these are great. And I think the bigger pads they do, um, I think you can get smaller ones, but these big ones I found worked the best for me for those for those reasons and we get these ones these are baby kind ones and we get these from Akajo I think they're also sold on Amazon but a bit more expensive than in Akajo but I'm sure if you can't find these ones or Akajo doesn't deliver to you then I'm sure you can find similar ones in a supermarket or boots or something near you okay so moving on to creams we use Suda cream for Theo it's worked really, really well from the beginning. He hasn't had nappy rash yet and he's nearly four months old and we, we apply this every time we change his nappy just as a preventative measure. We also have the Panthen. Not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but that's how I pronounce it. Now this one is was recommended. Um, several of my friends have said that this is great if your baby does have nappy rashes. They find it a lot more effective than the Sudocrem. Um, but I find for everyday nappy changes when Theo doesn't have nappy rash, which he hasn't had before, I find this a bit oily and a bit greasy and quite hard to work with. So I would say if you want to try it, then give it a go, see if it works for you. But I would just bear in mind that um, after I've used it, my hands are kind of quite covered in this oily, greasy um, substance, and which didn't really work well for me. So we use the Sudocrem. The other thing that I have in here are the nappy bags. So we just have these boxes of nappy bags in here and um, they're great, not only for putting the dirty nappies in, but also when you have bits that leak out of nappies, out of the sides, out of the back, then when you have to change clothes, they're pretty handy just to put the clothes in there so you can kind of contain, contain them and before you take them and put them in the washing machine or your washing basket. So I found those really useful for that. Um, Lastly, we have some things just for some clear up. So hand gel, kind of find this always quite useful. So when I finish changing Theo's nappy and before I get him dressed, I always just put a bit of this on my hands just to give them a quick clean before I start putting his clothes back on. And also my kind of surface wipes. We use these Dettol wipes um, just to clean down his changing mat, just to keep it nice and clean, free of bacteria. Um, just a nice environment for him and so also what we found was quite handy to have just in our nappy changing um, basket is, is some cream 
never know babies when they're when they're very little and I know they get all their their skin skin rashes um, the recommendation was not to put anything on their skin but I think once they're over a month old and you can then start putting substances on their skin we found the Aveeno baby range worked well for us and has kept Theo skin looking really healthy it's not too greasy it absorbs really nicely so this I would definitely recommend and to keep all of our nappy changing stuff kind of handy, we have several of these kind of baskets around the house with all of the stuff in there. So you can see we've got the, the Dettol wipes, the nappy bags, the wipes are in here, we've got the cream, the pseudo cream, and then the nappies here. And we found this is so useful just to have a few of these around the house, just so that you can change this nappy in lots of different locations. And also just keeps everything all neat and tidy in there. It's also come in so handy when we're trying to leave the house in a rush. So if we're going over to like a grandparent's house or a friend's house and maybe my nappy bag isn't um, fully stocked, I know that I can just pick up one of these baskets and know that I have everything in there, but it's straight in the car, straight under the buggy and everything's in there. So I hope you found that useful. Let me know in the comments whether this is the type of video that you'd like to see again. I'd love to hear from you about what you think, any products that you use for nappy changing that work really well for you and also let us know if there's any other topics you'd like us to cover. Um, as always, if you like this video, please get the like button, share it with your friends, and do subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already. Hey folks, we hope you've enjoyed this video and took some really great ideas to help you on your journey through life. We'd really love to hear from you, so leave us a comment. And if you wanna continue on the journey with us, then subscribe to our channel.